Hi, it's Susie Wise, the creator of Dating Secrets for DivorcedWomen.com. Now today we're going to talk about how to meet men well during your normal everyday activities. You know, one of the reasons that divorced women find it difficult to meet men is because, well, they're not noticing all the opportunities that show up actually every day. Well, today we're going to show you how to think outside the box when shopping at Whole Foods. Yep, Whole Foods. Next time you go shopping for your favorite goodies to eat and drink, well, you'll all be also be shopping to meet men in a natural and easy way. You don't believe me? Well, just listen up to what I have to say. What makes shopping at Whole Foods different is, well, people just love the experience. Not only are the food items amazing, but the shoppers, well, they tend to be really enthusiastic and very upbeat about being there. And that creates a very friendly setting to strike up a conversation with another shopper. But in this case, it's going to be a male shopper. Now, the first step when meeting a guy while shopping is don't be concerned if he's available or married or whatever. It just doesn't matter right now. You see, all that matters is you strike up a conversation with him. I mean, worst case is that you'll have a great conversation with a really nice man who may or not may or may or may not be available. Now, here's how it works. For a minute, let's just pretend you were standing at the cheese display and you ask the guy next to you if he has tried a variety of cheeses from cheese from here and what his favorite is. The conversation will take off from there. Or, you know, if you're standing by the bread display, ask the guy next to you what his favorite bread is. I mean, you could say, well, that you're overwhelmed with all the choices because believe me, that can help in there. Again, the conversation will easily take off from there. You see, here's the deal. Whatever aisle you are in, it's simple to start up a conversation. Well, because this is exactly what shoppers do all the time at Whole Foods. But I want you only to strike up a conversation with a male shopper, not a fem female shopper. And I want you to strike up a conversation with at least three men during your shopping adventure each and every time that you go to Whole Foods. Now, if you're thinking, this is crazy, this is not going to work, this is not where I'm going to meet available guys, I mean, if that's what you think, then think again. This is exactly the way many men and women have met and begun dating. But let's face it, if you don't put the effort to do it, well, I guess you're right. You'll never meet a guy while shopping at Whole Foods. And consider this. It is the most natural way to meet a guy, right? And the more times you do this, the better the odds that you will meet an available man. Who knows? I mean, he may just end up being Mr. Right. The choice is yours. Step outside of that herd mentality and discover a much more exciting and fulfilling life after divorce. Or just keep doing what you're doing. But ask yourself, is it working for you? For dating advice about how to meet men, go to my website, DatingSecretsForDivorcedWomen.com and check out our free dating secret articles and videos. This is Susie Wise. Hope to see you soon in my next video.